Subhanallah. Assalamu alaikum. My brothers and sisters, I received an email from a young boy telling me that his father calls him the worst possible names, swears him in such a bad way that it's affected his health, it's affected his mind, and he hates his father. My beloved mothers and fathers out there, don't call your children bad names. I've spoken about this so many times in the past. Your children are an amana. They are entrusted to you by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. If you are to use bad words to refer to them, wallahi, you will pay the price. Not only in this world, but even in the hereafter. So remember, call your children with beautiful names. Remember, ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's mercy. Not just your children, anyone who works for you or with you or people you interact, people you call, call them in the most beautiful way, speak to them very respectfully. Sometimes it's quite difficult, especially when they have worked on your nerves for a while, but still be respectful, still address them in a very unique, beautiful way. And Allah will grant you the goodness in the hereafter. Remember that my brothers and sisters, because too many children are suffering and struggling at the hands of their own parents and they cannot do anything about it because of the gap and the distance they have with their own parents. So I'm here telling you, my beloved father, my mother, please learn to address your children with utmost respect. That is an act of worship. These children belong to Allah. Allah is watching how you treat them, what you do to them, how you facilitate their lives, everything Allah is watching. And one day, He is definitely going to take you to task for what you've done. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help us become more conscious. May we be the most beautiful people such that our children enjoy living in our homes, within our own uh, houses, such that the day they leave, they miss us, they pray for us, and the day we leave, they would still uh, miss us and pray for us and ask Allah to forgive us rather than the good riddance statements that some may make. May Allah protect us all. Aqulu qawli hadha wa sallallahu wa sallam wa baraka ala nabina Muhammad. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.